Well, Richard, one thing is very representative of a healthy dog is an impressive shiny coat. been told the next dog has a particularly impressive coat. <laughs> sweet, sweet, get off. You're spoiling the whole thing. Go on off. No, not that way. Category, we'll be testing the dog's attitude to music. Watch this demonstration. was born to dance. You is Snoop Doggy Doo Doo. <laughs> Agility. Oh, I've just been told the next dog is particularly athletic. to the official prize-giving ceremony. Remember my promise? If Sweet wins a prize, I'll have to dress up as a dog and do the agility course myself. <laughs> well, he won't win any prizes. Sweet, I love you, but you were awful. I'd be a very bad judge if I didn't go with this audience. And I've got a very special award today. Goes to the most entertaining dog. The winner is... Sweet! <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, no, Sabina! <laughs> Oh, hello there. Mr. Slate has asked Richard to organise a world record breaking attempt today. It's so exciting. Sooty, what on earth are you doing? Breaking a world record? Oh, don't be silly. In 1986, Barry Kirk from Mid Glamorgan sat in a bath of beans for over a hundred hours. And you're going to beat that? Well, won't you get bored? You can always eat the beans. <laughs> then it won't be records you're breaking, sweep. Just wind. <laughs> Sweep. 
Not that kind of batter. It says you have to make batter with eggs, milk and flour. First of all, crack two eggs into a dish. Get that sorted. Two eggs into a dish. That's it. Off you go. Oh, very good. OK, and another one. You're going to need a glass of milk next. Right. Now, according to this book... <coughs> Excuse me. That's not for you to drink, is it, Smarty Patch? You've got to put... <laughs> You've got to put the milk in the bowl to make the batter. Pour it in. That's it. <laughs> Very good. Right, sweet. You're going to need to mix that up, so go and get a wooden spoon so you can mix the batter. <laughs> No, sweet, don't do that! Stop doing that! It's going everywhere! Are you awake? Well, I can't hear anyone walking about. I said I can't hear anyone walking about. Well, I can only hear one of you. Come on, get a move on. Are you out of bed yet? Is Sooty awake? Well, go and wake him up. That's what he? Hey, I'm all wet. <laughs> yes, I can see that. Thank you very much. Actually, I'm all wet thanks to this little scamp. So it seems sweet that you could swim after all. 
All you needed was confidence. Yes, you're right. What's that, Sooty? And a great big bone. Yes, certainly. You're right there as well. What else? A great big bonehead to fall in the water. Yeah. All right, that'll do. Thank you very much. Mind you, I was very impressed with you, Sweet. Do you know, you swam like a fish. You were a star. the first picture, Richard? Sooty says it's going to make a real splash. <laughs> yes, you could say that, Sue. Oh, you're here, are you? And I suppose you want to take another picture of me. Well, OK, but as long as it's not next to any more swimming pools. No more swimming pools. Good. Right, what is it this time? You want to take a picture of me next to the go-kart track? Oh, it doesn't sound too bad. Hang on a minute. Let's get this straight. This is just me next to the go-kart track. As the cars go round and round. Oh, that sounds quite exciting, doesn't it? Oh, all right, then. Come on. What are you two up to? Oh. Where do you want me? Back a bit. OK. Here? Back a bit more. Oh, all right. Just here? Good. Sweet, what's the matter? You've just seen something. What? The spaceship? Where? Up there? Right, so let's get this straight. There's no swimming pools for me to fall into. No ropes tied around my trousers. Good. So what do you want me to do this time? You'd like me to put my face against the ice cream nozzle and smile. Oh, you mean this nozzle just here? Oh, yes. <laughs> I don't think so. I know what you've got planned. The minute I put my face next to that ice cream nozzle, you're going to take another silly picture of me. Oh, not this time. I'm going to stay right where I am and make a lovely ice cream like this. There we are. How's this? Yes. I need a flake. Well, that's quite a good idea. Where are the flakes? Over there. I'll just go and get one. Right, here I am. Let's go. Yes, that's true. What is it, Sweep? You found a leak in the kitchen. <laughs> Not that sort of leak, sausage brain. <laughs> Try this. Oh, no, Sooty. I meant try the pan to catch the water. Yeah, there. That should keep Richard happy. I am not happy. I think I spoke too soon. Oh, hello there. Do you know, I hate the rain. Hello. 
Oh, hello, gang. Mr Slater's having closed the park. That rain is torrential. Yes, it is. Do you know, I can still hear the sound of rain in my ears. It's almost like it's raining in here. <laughs> it is. There's a hole in the bedroom ceiling. <laughs> All right. Hang on, what did you just say? There's a hole in the bedroom ceiling. Oh, no! <laughs> That's all we need, a leaky roof on a rainy day. You put the pans there to catch the rain. Well, that's very good, but what are you going to do when they fill up? Stop! Well, that's no good, is it? We're going to have to call the repairman. Come on! Mind you, I'm not sure a repairman's going to want to come out on a miserable day like this. No. Hey, you'll fix the leaks. You're experts. Oh, no, we've heard that before. <laughs> you'll start with the leak in the bedroom and you'll fix the leak in the bathroom. What leak in the bathroom? Excellent, boys. Get to it. <laughs> Hang on a minute. What leak in the bathroom? This gets worse. <laughs> hey! Hey, look what I found. It's Sue's Wendy house. The one that was in the photograph. Well, it's a bit dusty. It should clean up all right. I know what. Why don't we redecorate the house as a surprise for Sue? Not now he needs some petrol. <laughs> oh, no. Come on. Let's redecorate the house. <laughs> you need some petrol. Well, I'm sorry, but that isn't even a real petrol pump. <laughs> oh, that's very good. But I know that that hose is full of water and he's just going to squirt me. I know what. <laughs> Let's squirt sweet. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> Very funny. Come on, you two. Let's go and decorate this house. Come on, outside. Where can it be? Maybe I lost my necklace when I was in here. No. Nope. Oh, oh, you boys look ready. Hey, listen, if you build Sue's Wendy house, I'll make sure she doesn't come outside and ruin the surprise. <laughs> Don't worry, you're experts. Well, go on, then. Convince me. I must find that necklace. I must. Sue! Sue, where are you? What are you doing? Sue! Sorry, Richard. I'm trying to find my necklace. Well, don't panic, Sue. I'm sure it will turn up somewhere, but there really is no need to make all this mess. Where is it? Sue! <laughs> Let's hear it for Master Magician Sooty and his magic rabbit, Jack. <laughs> Keep your applause going, folks. You decide the winner of Slater's talent competition. The louder you clap, the more the clapometer will rise. Wow, Sooty's scoring an amazing 70 points there. And now it's time to bring Las Vegas to Slater's. Please welcome the very glamorous Sue, accompanied by Sutarachi. <laughs> But will it be enough to win the talent competition? And what's this? Ladies and gentlemen, it looks like we have a last-minute entrant. All we know is they are called the Sweepex.
Bye bye, everybody. Bye bye. Jolly well serves you right. Now listen here, sweet. All dogs have to swim, and that is that. But listen, there's a nice juicy reward for you at the end of it. <laughs> Not yet. First of all, Sue and Sooty are going to show you how it's done, OK? And you're going to pay attention, right? First of all, Sue and Sooty are going to demonstrate the breaststroke. And now they're going to demonstrate the front crawl. Finally, they're going to demonstrate a wonderful backstroke. What do you think of that, Sweep? 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 Where is he?